Hello and welcome back to another ep another t tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install Obsidian Tools mod for my uh to the current version of Minecraft is now 1.2.5, but I will update the the ver I will update the links for the newest versions of Minecraft as soon as they come out. You will know if the newest version if the links have been updated. If in the description it says links updated for the the version that Minecraft is updated for at the moment. But as you can see, right at this moment, we have uh, we have our obsidian pickaxe and obsidian sword, obsidian spade or shovel, however you want to say it. And we got our axe, obsidian axe, uh, and as you can see, or obsidian and our obsidian hoe, hoe. So I believe it's it's as good as a uh, diamond. I believe. Let me just go test that out. Uh, well. I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys how to install it right now. So if I go save and quit to title, you will need two mods for this. You will need to install two. Uh, you will need to download two links to install this mod. The first one is gonna be Mod Loader for the newest version of Minecraft, and also the Obsidian mod. Uh, let me just go ahead and find my Mod Loader. So both of those links should be Add Fly links. So if you guys do not know what Add Fly links are, let me just go ahead and refresh my page. But as you can see, these are all ads. Uh, and in this top right corner, it will say, "Please wait." And it'll start at five and count down all the way down to zero. And here you will often see, "Click here to download." Those are just ads. Uh, do not click those. Those will bring you to a page that you do not want to uh, open up. Uh, so then, it, once you click, you click on skip ad, your downloads will begin. And it says, "Do you want to open or save?" Just go ahead and save that to wherever you wish. Uh, either desktop or into your downloads or wherever you wish. Uh, both of those links, mod loader and the the and the Obsidian Tools mod will be an ad fly link. So then, once you've got both of those uh, uh, links downloaded, then you guys will, should should uh, have Obsidian Tools and mod loader. So then, uh, the next part, you're gonna go ahead and launch Minecraft. You're gonna go click options, force update done, and log in. If you guys do not know what a force update does, uh, sometimes uh, we have more than one mod, and sometimes it will not correspond well together. But usually, modeler is a modeler. I mean, Obsidian Tools mod is a pretty uh, popular mod, so it should correspond with every single mod. But uh, or another example, if you ever get if you ever install this guy's mod and it doesn't work and you get a black screen, just go ahead and click Options, do a force update, and this will set your Minecraft.jar back to its original state. So that once uh, it's done loading up, you guys can just go ahead and close out of Minecraft, just like so. Then you're gonna go ahead and find your Minecraft .jar. If you guys don't know how to find that, I'm sure about to show you guys how to install, it, uh, how to f go ahead and find your Minecraft .jar. So if you go ahead and hold Shift and Number Five, which will give you percentage sign, percentage A P P D A T A, percentage app data percentage, then hit Enter. Now this should open up. Then you're gonna want to go into your dot Minecraft file folder. Then you're gonna go into your bin. Then you're gonna a single click your Minecraft because if you double click, you get an error, just like so. So just go ahead and right click it. And you're gonna go open with WinRAR Archiver, or you can either open it with 7-Zip. If you guys do not have either WinRAR Archiver or 7-Zip or any type of zipping file, then you guys will be needing to go install that. Let's go look up a video on YouTube. Then you guys will know how to install it. So just go ahead and double click your WinRAR. Then you can close out of the other page but keep your minecraft.jar open and as you can see the first thing you will need to do is delete your meta if you guys do not know where your meta fold file folder is uh... it is uh, your a folder it's like an anti-mod mojang the creators of minecraft put this so it's like an anti-mod well it's a short quick way to install it uh... you will quick way to explain it i mean you will need to delete this any other video will tell you to delete to delete it and tell you to do the same thing just go ahead and do, do go ahead and do that. So just go ahead and just and delete it. There's two ways to of deleting it. Either you right click it, click delete, or go up here and click the delete button and click yes. So there you go. It is gone, all deleted. Then you're gonna go ahead and open up your mod loader, uh, just like so. And then you're gonna bring it over to the side, and you can click and drag all of these class files from vx dot class all the way up to adl dot class. Just go ahead and do that. Click and drag all of these class files. Click and drag these down here, and hit OK. 
Uh, now a lot of people mess up uh, doing clicking and dragging these file folders because uh, most a lot of people will just click and drag them up here. But if you drop them up here, there is a possibility that they will fall into one of these file folders, which will possibly make your Minecraft crash. So just make sure to drop them down here so they will not fall into one of these file folders. And you can just go ahead and close out of your out of your modloader.zip, and you're gonna go ahead and open up Obsidian Tools. Close out of uh, that if that opens up. Now, once you've got um, Obsidian Tools.zip open, uh, same process. Click and drag all of these. Uh, I think uh, drag all these class files and this one file folder. Just go ahead and do that. Click and drag, and same process. Don't drop them up here because there's a possibility that they will fall into one of the folders. So drop them down here and hit OK, and you should be all ready to go. So if I go ahead and launch up Minecraft, click login. Now just wait, wait a couple seconds for it to load up. I go single player in my new world, or whatever world you have opened up. As you can see, I've got my Obsidian tools, and if I scroll down, I should see uh, my Obsidian tools also, as well. So, uh, uh, it's, uh, this is, uh, this concludes the, my tutorial. If you guys uh, enjoyed enjoyed this tutorial, then feel free to like the video. If you guys have any problems with song this mod, then just leave me a comment, and I will do my best to help you guys out. Um, that's pretty much it. If uh, feel free to subscribe as I do post daily videos, and you guys have a nice day.